I get weirdly excited whenever I start like suffering mentally and in today's video I want to just like dive into why that is because I know that just sounds weird to most people right so I have like this view on suffering right where I know it's temporary I know that I'm not going to be suffering forever I know that it will end oh. There we go. I know that it's going to end, it's gonna be fine. And as hard as it is in that moment, I know I'm gonna be okay. I have that faith that life will be good again. And you know, sometimes like in especially rough seasons, that faith does go away. And I start to think like all the negative thoughts, but it always comes back. I always am reminded of that faith that I have that things will be good again and that I will make it out of the valley I have found myself in. And if you've been there, then you know what I'm feeling. You know what I'm talking about. And uh, it's hard, but ultimately all bad things must come to an end. And another thing that I've recently started doing is I've started to view my my spirit as if it's a garden, right? And in this garden, at first everything was just plain. It was just all a barren nothingness, right? It was just boring, honestly. But it is through these hardships that valleys have started to form and at first I didn't like those valleys I didn't like all of the cracks in the ground and it hurt my spirit it hurt me mentally it hurt my happiness I felt worse because of it but after a while of those valleys being there water started to flow through them and when that water started to flow, grass started to grow. So did flowers, so did trees. And eventually that garden in my spirit has become something beautiful. It has become this lovely place to be. And it is only through those valleys that were carved through the hardships that the spiritual garden has grown. We need to go through suffering in order to grow and develop as people. And as much as we don't like it in the moment, as much as it hurts in the moment, eventually we will realize that that suffering didn't just go to waste. And that there was a good reason why we had to go through it. And that something good will inevitably come out of any sort of suffering that we face. That's everything I have to say today. Keep running when no one else is. Thank you for watching.